Connecticut's new rapid transit system from New Britain to Hartford has only been operational for a couple of months now, and the state is already announcing an expansion of service. CT Fast Track is the line going to be expanded to east of Hartford all the way to Manchester. Our chief political correspondent, Mark Davis, joins us live now with the very latest. Good afternoon, Mark. Good afternoon, Keith. Good afternoon, everyone from New Britain and just outside the CT Fast Track station. You know, the critics, while this was being built, said this was a boondoggle and it wouldn't work. It clearly is working. The governor came here today to proclaim CT Fast Track a big success. For the first two months, the system is averaging over 14,000 riders a day on weekdays. Now, that's way exceeding the 11,000 they had projected after the first year. It means, according to the governor, that many, many people are ready to use rapid transit, so he plans to expand to East Hartford and Manchester by using the high-occupancy vehicle lanes on Interstate 84. East of the river service would extend access uh, to those employed at Pratt & Whitney and Goodwin College, uh, in addition to many other uh, large and small employers uh, in those two towns. Now, that service is going to take uh, less than a year, they say, for this expansion uh, because they don't have to build another highway like they did for uh, this eastern, uh, this western part of it. Uh, they can use, as I said, the high occupancy vehicle lanes on uh, 84 east of the river, but they need to scope out areas where they can put in stations, smaller ones than this, uh, and places for people to park. And the governor says that should happen within 12 months. Uh, we'll have uh, more on this and reaction from riders coming up tonight starting at 5. Live in New Britain, Mark Davis, News 8.